Supra means go beyond or surpass, which it sure did. The Supra came from the lineage of Celica. Initially, it was just a trim of Celica that was more longer and came with a 5ME engine. Supra even got help from Lotus on the design and tune for its independent suspension. In 87, Supra was released as a separate model from Celica and came equipped with a 200 HP 7M motor. And the turbocharged version came with 230 HP. It even got the 1JZ GTE in certain markets. By this time, Supra and Sura used the same platform. Finally, the Mark IV Supra was released in 93. Its main goal was to dominate the Japanese market, which had cars such as 300ZX, RX-7, NSX and 3000 GT. The AD Supra came with two engine options and naturally aspirated 2JZ or the legendary twin turbo 2JZ GTE which was sequential unlike the traditional parallel system but a cockpit straight out of a fighter jet as the designers would want it. It was highly popular among the tuner community thanks to its domination in many races but reached a whole new level when the first Fast and the Furious movie was released. This car has its own cult following as it was one of the most reliable cars ever made and the amount of power that can be extracted from the cast iron block seems to be limitless especially with a get drag transmission. The combination makes a car extremely robust making it capable of reaching horsepower figures that can only be achieved by hypercars. The engine's iron block, forged rotating assembly and low compression pistons can handle 700 HP at the wheels pretty reliably. The car looks amazing decades later since its launch. There are only a few other cars that can match up to its legendary status. It would take another 16 years before the next Supra was introduced. That unfortunately had to be mostly built for BMW to keep the prices low. But Toyota has very strict quality standards that it's known for. So expect somewhat similar kind of reliability from the A90 Supra. Do hit that like button if you enjoyed this video and check out the store support the stand in the description below and talk to you.